Hi there, this is Rich Page, and this is a homepage conversion review for atipso.com. Okay, so I'm going to look at this through the eyes of a conversion rate expert, that's myself, and I'm also going to look at the eyes through a first-time visitor, because it's important you understand what type of questions they may have, and what um, what they may be looking at first, and whether you meet their needs, because if you don't, they're going to go back to Google and try and find something that does meet their needs better. Okay, so I see um, you are in the landing page tool business and one of the immediate challenges of this is there's so many of these now so one of the most important things you need to do is show your unique value proposition or key reasons to what use this tool rather than the, the other tools out there like unbounce um, or lander app or um, optimize press for example um, so I'm on your homepage and I see a tip so I, I doesn't I don't immediately know what this is it's a very unfortunately a very um, non-specific and then for a company, I would definitely add a tagline under here, yeah, uh, landing page expert tool or something, um, to help clarify that. The logo is a little bit small too. It's, I like um, how you've got features here and a tour as your main options. Start creating is a good call to action. Um, I'm going to go through the rest of the page. Create awesome landing pages and campaign yourself. As a headline, I think um, it, you need to be a bit more impressive because someone that's likely to be looking at landing pages is going to be looking at many of these offerings and this 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 doesn't really do you any justice you need to um mention either a pain point that, that your typical customers will have or um, mention why yours is the best um what features what benefits that you have that others don't okay i don't know what those are for example the easiest way to engage your visitors that this doesn't seem very appealing at all and very vague and you don't want to engage your visitors you really want to convert them so that's what someone's going to want to do with a landing page tool or to convert them into a lead or, or a sale um i, I like this uh, visual of the uh in action you can't see the rest of it the guy's cut off so you might want to resize this a bit better but i guess it's good that it um focuses on this Let's go continue scrolling down. Sp create spread engage as the way you bring your campaign to life. Hmm. It seems spread seems a strange one. Um, it almost looks to me that reading this is that you do more than just have a landing page tool. So that needs clarifying for for business. That's the way you make your for marketers for agencies. Uh, these two, there's a fine line between these two, I've, which you're probably going to have challenges with. Or, or often marketeers are out of business, and oft, often businesses use marketeers, obviously. So that's immediately causing some conflict there. That's the way you make your marketing campaign for your business more successful. Which way? This seems a bit confusing. Content creation in the blink of an eye. Marketers, APIs come into web systems. This doesn't seem a very. This seems more of a technical thing. Um, for agencies, check our prices. Just a few clicks, drag and drop. Kind of few takes forms. See, so you, you need to. Like, this stuff needs to be below this stuff. You need to show exactly what your tool does first, and then talk about who it's who the who it's for. You can kind of highlight this above. Um, I'm going to continue exiting temp pop ups. Okay, promotion channel. Let's go. Connect content. Cross media marketing can be that easy. Come on, you're different. This seems a bit vague. I don't really understand this, to be honest. Cross media marketing can be that easy. It doesn't really say that your tool does this, it just says combine your content. From different sources and spread them through. What's the benefit? And you don't mention the benefit of doing that. Spread content. Spreading is a really strange word. Uh, spreading makes it, or, you know, I, don't, I never think of I'm spreading something. I think of I'm, you know, doing it via social media or um, that's the. 
it just seems strange this whole section here the whole spread word and why you're going after that so it doesn't, it doesn't really make much it doesn't seem a very key aspect of, of landing page tools that i've ever seen anyone mention unless so and you don't do a really good job of explaining why this is so important and why maybe yours does a really good job of that let's pull you from the beginning start creating okay so it's it's a bit it's a bit vague. Um, there's not there's not the, you need more imagery of of the different things on this page of the different elements of your tool. But that's the only image. I guess there's these two, but these hopefully these pop up. Um, yeah, they looks like they do. Discover more. Yeah, I think you need to eliminate some of the stuff that's kind of confusing. That's the way you bring your campaign to. I mean, this is uh, this is not particularly good. It's easy to bring a campaign. Anyone can bring a campaign to life by creating a, a landing page. That's doesn't, that doesn't seem the main thing that you're probably going to want to be selling your tool on. As I said, you want to make sure that you are explaining why yours is better than anyone else. And what I would do is have some short bullet point checklists of reasons to use your service and the benefits of your service of your landing page tool service. Um, instead of someone else and maybe i'm completely wrong maybe i've just seen this word landing pages and uh thinking that you're a landing page tool and if that's the case i don't see any uh, this uh, this isn't particularly well explained to make me understand what's so different about this um, and how it's so useful and how it's going to benefit me or your potential visitors so i would hope your features page is, is much better and you also need a, a more compelling uh uh, call to action buttons I would give them some kind of free trial and um, free 30-day trial because there isn't enough information on here to convince me um, to even want to potentially click on the rest of, the, of this because it just seems very confusing you don't you, you should also add some testimonials on here there's no testimonials um, you, you don't mention who is behind this you don't mention if you've been mentioned um, on in any uh, media outlets, if you've been mentioned on any trendy websites that will help build trust and credibility. Um, you don't mention how long you, you've been doing this, um, how many clients you have, you don't have logos of clients. This to me looks like a brand new tool um, and it would make me think, hmm, do, do I really want to use something that, that looks like it's brand new? That's the perception I'm getting. Okay, so um, that's my opinion of the homepage, and hopefully that helped. Thanks.